Mommy, that's the puppy I want. Can we have that one, please, Mommy? Look, it wants to lick my face. Please, Mommy, can we have that one, please, Freddy, please? Now, son, keep in mind, we don't want to die. Welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. And this place still creeps me the frick out. Pretty much. Yeah. Okay, but... Oh, yeah, that's right. We can... Oh, yeah, that, yeah, bleh, 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 bleh. The water flowing out of this statue is flooding the entire floor. We get back to a little water temple mechanic. Play the Zelda's... Well, not the Zelda's lullaby. Play Zelda's lullaby and the water level changes. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we got something going on here. There's a pot down here. Down, down here. Down there. Look at there, there. Whatever. Uh, what's this? Oh. Skulltula! No, not Skulltula. Skulltula, jeez. I've noticed that. I've said Golden Skulltula and all this kind of crap. I mean Skulltula, jeez. I should have figured out that by now, but obviously not. Yeah, Dense Fire kills just about everything. Very practical, this spell. It is. Whatever, okay. This wall, it says something here. Danger above. That's what it says. Yeah, that's a Skulltula, by the way. That's a Skulltula again! Skulltula! Tulla! Tulla! Eh! Yeah. Okay. Don't go this way, it's just going to... Like, it's a... It's a fake hole. It's... It's an invisible hole there. You can't see it, but it's invisible. So it makes sense. It all adds up. Pretty much. What's in here? That was trippy. Uh, okay, I'm just going to ignore that, because that seems suspicious. Conspicuously suspicious. Uh, okay. So now that the water level is well sunk, you can go down here. And you can go into the hole. The hole. The hole. Okay. Also, oh, more skulls. Jeez. Well, at least I said it right. That's something. Um, could you? like turn around and stuff now thank you you are dead mister hopefully it stays that way it would be the best for all of humanity oh is this the room yeah that is the room this room is probably the cause of many nightmares of many many people in the history of Zelda oh my goodness hand grabbing but what does this hand grabbing mean it means that this freaking psycho appears out of nowhere is the dead hand. Watch out for its infinite. Watch out for its infinite hands. Aim for its head. Yeah, this thing is just the, the epitome of creepy, pretty much. And it's yeah, just creepy altogether. It's very creepy. I can't explain it any other way. It's disturbing, creepy, and all that is bad in this world. It used dense fire. What happens then? Okay, nothing. Just be that way. Jeez. Gotta save up some of my magic. So, to make the dead hand appear again, just grab by one of the hands. Just get your way out of there, because you don't want to be grabbed by a hand when this dead hand appears out of nowhere and just blah, blah, blah. Just creepy like that. Go head down here, mister. It looks... I don't know. How, how can anyone come up with this kind of creepy stuff? I don't know. I, I'm just a bit curious about that. How can anyone come up with something this creepy? Same same thing was re same thing with Redeads and Guy Gas and Brood Mother and stuff things. Yeah, I watched some disturbing enemy top ten list. I don't know why I do it. It just creeps me out afterwards anyway. Yeah, I suppose it's kind of like adrenaline. It makes it like it makes you want to go for a ride. In the roller coaster, and then you just piss your pants. Kinda. Stop grabbing my face! I need my face for eating. Yeah, by the way, eating. Hello. Can you die? Yeah. Whoa, don't fall on me. That would just be not nice. This thing is very creepy and disturbing and everything, but it's, re it's really easy to defeat. That's, that's no secret. And when we have defeated the creepiness... I will have chortles, and I will make a bread of with a something. I don't know. I'm not thoughtful. Stop it. 
Stop referencing Mario and Luigi series. Okay, you found the lens of truth. Set it to see and press C to look through it. Mysterious things are hidden everywhere. Be sure to try to use it outside of the well. Seeing the truth will cause magic power, so press C again to stop using it. That's true. See what I did there? Lens of truth? That's true? <gasps> That's not funny. Okay, let's just pick up this thing. Let's see, there's nothing in here, is there? No, there's not. Wait, there is, actually. There's a chest over here. You should have this equipped for quite a lot of time, so... Whoa, you... I just... Uh, I should have upgraded my wallet already. I just... Well, do I have enough skull tools to do that anyway? Uh... Yeah, I do. I have more than enough. Holy crap. Okay, gotta do that when I'm finished up here. Although I'm going to do something different as well when I'm finished up with this crap hole. Mm, yeah. Ignore the ignore the giant spider kids, just move along, move along. Go ahead. Now with that we have the lens of truth, was it which is obviously the dungeon's main item. Um uh, well this means we're almost finished, I think. I think we actually are finished. Not too sure about it though. Gotta think a bit. Isn't that all we need? Yeah. But I'm going to demonstrate it a bit inside of this dungeon, just to you know, you can pretty much get how the thing works if you don't already know. Um, so as the, well, you see this circle inside the red line. That's where the truth is hidden. Kinda. That's where you can see the truth, pretty much. That's where you can see hidden exits and stuff like that. Yeah. I think you all you actually need to do in here is actually just, you know, go ahead and... Go ahead and, you know, get the blends of truth and then you can exit again. But I'm not too sure about it. Uh, also, bats, I hate you. Go away. Uh, what? Oh, Golden Skull too low. Well, I'll... Well, I'll be dang. I'll get out my Skulltula hunting business stuff, I suppose. I suppose. Um, yeah. Hold it on at the boomerang. Go away! Dang you! Go die in a corner. Or, or, you know, just fall down the pit. That works as well. Wow, I was about to move my controller now. I'm, I'm way too used to the gyroscope controls here on the 3DS. Holy crap, dude. Okay, sadly it doesn't work that way on the Nintendo 64. I'm really glad they added that gyroscope thing though. Really helpful, really cool, just great addition altogether. Okay, Gold Sculptula, Coolio. And the way was into the no! Dang you, Alternite, you are a dumbass. Now we gotta climb out of the re dead hole again. That sounds disgusting, and it is. It is quite disgusting. Crap. Well, at least I got the Sculptula. There's something good in that. Still have to hear about the re -dead moaning, though, but still. I can survive that. Yeah, I think so, anyway. So, what is there to talk about? Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> I saw... <laughs> I saw Nintendo Capri Sun's uh, Let's Play Episode 9, I believe it is, of Conqueror's Bad Fur Day, and I have to say, most hilarious thing I've seen in forever. I was nearly laughing out the whole episode after he, well, fought the, you know, boss. It was just, it was just ridiculous. It was the best Let's Play episode I've seen in forever now, pra practically, pretty much. You can just think what am I doing? What am I doing? Ow! Okay, I don't need to have that dang lens equipped all the time. And why did I even stun it? It could have just slashed or something. Oh well. Let's get out of the well. Everything's going to be well when we get out of the well. Oh jeez. Did I just make up another horrible pun? Uh, pun episode name? I think I did. Just like that very cool dungeon name when we were on the ice cave thing and everything was, you know, cool because it's cold inside a cave that's made of ice. Uh, I never learn. 
I never do. Never ever. Never. I know, seriously, never. I never learn. Just ask my math teacher. It's true. Okay, anyway. Um. Well, oh yeah, I was going to get the giant wallet thing, so I can carry more rupees. Dang it. Okay, let me see. The guy is not here. He is the one in the middle, in front. Hello. The curse has been broken. Thank you. Here's a reward for you. And now we get the biggest wallet in the game. The giant's wallet. You can carry up to 500 rupees. Dang, I should have had that before heading into the well. Now it's too late, because I am a fool of a duke. I haven't said that in a while, so just don't nag. Anyway, I think that's... Yeah, that should just about do it for this episode. We're up to 10 minutes. That's okay. 10 minutes of my st stupidity is more than any... Well, more than anyone ever should have to suffer. So, I'm just saying. <coughs> cough, cough. Thanks for watching this episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the next episode, we will be doing some more stuff for something or another in a galaxy far, far away. Goodbye.